about to install the first mod on yes jamel's brand new mustang so let's get the before shot what we got here in the back man they <laughs> All right, so we got Jamel's car right here and we're doing a RTR conversion front grill. Already got this part out and everything. All we gotta do now is get his two bolts that are right here. And it's, I believe it's about, about 14 bolts down there. And we already got the one, two, three, four, five, six bolts. And then the two little hidden bolts that go right here. So I'm working on the bottom right now. Don't get it all, make this mug look better. Yes, sir. <laughs> this mug already look better without the, without the license plate though, for real though. Yeah. What's it supposed to rain today? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't gonna take long to put on. I was just putting it back together. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's, it's snapping out. <laughs> uh oh. Final one. I got the girl off. Bye bye, phone. We ain't here getting that work. Fingers hurt. <laughs> Fingers hurt. Shout out to Lawrence Whip that you ain't here, but we about to take for a test drive and like burn all your tires out, bruh. <laughs> Come back in town. You gonna need some tires. You gonna need some tires when you go back in town. Sure, but it's looking good, man. It's All right, change it up. All right. So certain RTR lights, you gotta wire them a certain way. So you got two wires. You got a ground, black, and you got power. How we're gonna connect is on every time you turn the side marker lights on. So I'm gonna tap into that green wire right there, which would be the power, and that black wire. It don't look black, but it's the dark one, the darkest one. And that's what I'm gonna tap into for the uh, pretty much the brown. And then uh, I gotta kind of push it back a little bit. And once I do that, be all good. Woo! First test. Oh! Hey, that look good, man. That look real good. All right, so we just finished up the grill install. Is side marker lights, but just so y'all can see it. And like I said, when you're installing it, this bolt, so it's, it's one, two, three, four, five, six. And then you got one hidden little bolt right here. One hidden room bolt right here. And you got one bolt that goes in right here. That's gonna be like the heart of the bolt. And then you got, I believe it's like 14 bolts that all the way at the bottom. It's a simple, easy install, but you also, you gotta take this out though. But shit. How you like it, bro? Love it. <laughs> Money is nice. Oh God, make me miss my lights. Waiting on my boy Jamel right now. Trying to see if he's gonna pull up any time now because you know, just like black people, they gotta be late. So, trying to get like a cool video of his car pulling up. You know, because that's what car people do. What we doing today is we checking out the last day of the STO. We actually checking out the STO auto show this time. So we're gonna see like the cars on the inside. Y'all already saw the drifting and everything. 
So right now I'm checking out, you know, what type of car, show y'all everything. A little bit of my knowledge, which I think I got a good little amount of knowledge. Yeah, I Like it's nice though. Nice. I'm just saying, man. It it's a thought. It's a thought. Yeah, this is it. What's up, little guy? They got you working the whole weekend. Saturday, yeah, the whole weekend. I feel you. How much is that one? Yeah, this one hard. You gonna get it? You gonna get the car? <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, now I see it in person. That's what I'm saying. Like it's different because like that's is extremely aggressive. Carbon fiber wheels. That dude's just hopping inside everybody, like, he ain't supposed to get in. I know it's people out here that love G wagons, but I'm not one of them. They just look like a they look like a Jeep. <laughs>